Good morning, guys. It is Monday, October 24th, 2022. It's 7.17 a.m. And it is time to make some breakfast. There we go, guys. We got some breakfast. We got some turkey sausage, some scrambled eggs, slice of raisin bread, and some orange juice. It is another day in the world. Breakfast. Good morning, guys. Yep, it is Monday, October 24th, 2022. Just left the apartments. They're right there. <laughs> and yeah, heading off to campus now. It's time for the second half of the first semester. That's right. Eight weeks behind us, and now eight weeks ahead of us. This is week nine. And it's going by pretty fast, actually. And yeah, I got classes and all that stuff. Heading to geography. Morning, guys. They got the sprinklers going off on the fields this morning. You gotta, you gotta keep the grass watered. Keep the grass green. And yep, walk into school. Well, they got the homecoming game against Idaho this next Saturday, guys. Yeah, that's, yeah my dad's gonna be in town this weekend. <coughs> Coming up. Just a little bit longer. We got Starbucks over here. Peak Adventures, cool place. I just noticed something, guys. Look at this. This tree is marked 775. So there's 774 other numbers on campus. I don't know. I'm gonna go look on another tree. Oh, yep, yeah, look. Oh, damn. 2,528 on this pine right here. Two thousand five hundred twenty-six. So is this one twenty-five twenty-five? Um, yep, two thousand five hundred twenty-five. Then I like all the trees marked. Pine cone impact area. Ooh. Yeah, 2523. So yeah, I guess all the trees have markings, guys. Yeah, look, 2524. Interesting. So it would take a long time to find all the stamps. We gotta find tree number one one of these days. Tree number one and tree number 1,996 since I was born in 1996. <laughs> I'll find them eventually. But here's all the other trees outside of good old Sequoia Hall in the geography department. Hey guys, just got out of geography class. We talked about air and relative humidity and all that good stuff today. Yeah, you know, humidity and dew point and all that. But yeah, I am um, 
heading over to the University Union now. I'm gonna hang out a little bit until my noon class. Yeah, that's the plan, it would seem. Anyway, I will check in shortly. Hey guys, it's right around 11 a.m. Days continuing on. My next class still has, well, my next class is still an hour away. Doesn't start until noon. Yeah, just kind of lingering around and walking around, killing a little bit of time. I gotta find something to fill in the gaps, you know? Oh look, it's another tree. This one's number 2503. <laughs> Dang, that's a lot of even trees they went around and labeled. I was just thinking about that. If they've marked like every tree on campus, then or just about every tree. I saw some like narrow trees earlier that weren't marked, or at least I didn't see a marker on them. Maybe they weren't, and, and, and I just missed it. Hang on, let me check. Let me check this one. Although this one's larger. That one does not have a marker. So I guess that not all of them do. Yeah, I don't know which ones they mark then and which ones they don't. Because that one is not marked. Interesting. Interesting for sure. What about this one right over here? I'm gonna check this one. Um, doesn't look like it. Are they only marking pine trees? I'm not sure. Maybe they're only marking pine trees. But that wouldn't make a lot of sense either. Why would they only mark one type of tree? That would be like... Biased. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about. Anyway, I'm just, as you can see, walking. All around. Everywhere and nowhere. I gotta get something to eat. Gotta eat some lunch or something, you know. Now that's a palm tree and that one has a marker, but I can't really get to it because it's in this perimeter thing. But it did have a marker. Um, yeah, so I'm not sure how they determined which trees they marked and not. And that little tree over there is a plaque. I'm gonna go see what it says. And then maybe we'll end this portion of the video. Um, it says, in honor of Dolores Herta, or Horta, farm worker, labor learner, civil rights advocate for a lifetime of at devoted commitment to human rights. It's a nice dedication. Anyway, guys, this this video segment said like four minutes, so I'm gonna wrap it up. And I'll check in with you in a bit later in the day. There we go, guys. We got some lunch. Food. Class just got out, guys. Just finished up another day in Intro to the Old Testament. Now I am heading yeah, back towards the apartment. My apartment. So yeah, 
The day continues on, guys. Starting to warm up a little. You can see the benches here are interesting shapes. Oh yeah, the sun is out. Here's the practice fields from this morning. Yeah, you gotta use water to keep stuff green in California. It's another nice day. Anyway, it's about, yeah, don't have much really planned for the rest of the day. Um, got an extra credit opportunity in my class from today, my Old Testament class. Uh, it's not for a few days though, but I'm probably going to do that because, I mean, you know, extra points. I mean, yeah, I'll take them. Anyway, I'll check in soon, just continuing my walk back to the good old apartment. Hey guys, I'm just chilling in my room. It's 3.38 p.m. It's a very lazy day. <laughs> Nothing going on. I'm in a bit. I'm going to, what a bit, two hours. Or so, around 5.30 to 6, I'll probably make dinner. Yeah. I got some, like, barbecue stuff I can make. Or I got pasta stuff. I think I got some fried rice, but I don't really have any chicken. Um, I'll think of something. Anyway, though. Yeah, I'll check in in a bit, I guess. Today's video is going to be real low-key and laid back and a bunch of who knows what just just life what's up guys um yeah it's around 4 50. it's almost five i'm heading over to the dollar tree to pick up a few things just did a bunch of dishes. Um, well, I did a, I did mine, but then there's some other ones that have been sitting in the sink several days, so I did all of those too, and whoever they are, they could just put them away, but I washed and rinsed them. But yeah, I am going to go to the Dollar Tree now, because I need to get some more napkins and paper towels, and Maybe a few other things when I'm there. I'm not sure. I up the Dollar Tree is where I am heading at the moment. Uh, check in momentarily. There we are, guys. The good old Dollar Tree. Yep. I'm gonna go to the Dollar Tree, get some stuff, avoid broken glass. That's the goal. Gotta avoid that broken glass, guys. Don't want to end up with shards of glass in your feet. And look at all the Christmas stuff. Halloween. Yeah, they got Halloween stuff, definitely, because Halloween's still going up, but they got all the Christmas stuff in as well, guys. Oh, here you go. Hand soap. Ghost. Ghostly hand soap, guys. Good old York, white chocolate Kit Kats, those are always good. Good old stuff. Hey guys, it's 516. I got the paper towels and the napkins from 
Dollar Tree and I am now walking right back to the apartment. Very eventful trip, but that's all I really needed. I'm gonna go home and shortly make dinner. I'm gonna have some of that, what's it called? The Jack Daniels barbecue honey pulled pork I got. So yeah, see you soon. Let's make some dinner. Hawaiian sweet rolls can never go wrong. I will be having some of you next week, Jam. Oh, there we go. Tennessee honey. Oh, the pork. Microwave or stovetop or oven. Do one or the other. There we go, guys. Just put it on. Now we just gotta heat it up. We gotta heat it up. We got a couple of these sliced. I'm gonna have extras, I'll ask roommates if they want some, because we got plenty of meat. <laughs> Definitely enough for several people. It's starting to heat up now, look at that. We got bubbling and all types of stuff. I've also got some pineapple. I might open that. Some canned pineapple. It's still pretty sweet though. It's the Del Monte Deluxe Gold. It's pretty tasty. Can you ask? Roommates, if they want any pulled pork. All right, guys, I'll check in soon. Dinner is almost ready. There we go, guys. Check it out. Jack Daniels Tennessee honey pulled pork on King's Hawaiian sliders. Yum, yum. We got some deluxe gold. <laughs> Dinner time, guys. We got our little pulled pork sandwiches. And I don't have that like a little cup thing, so I'm using a glass for my pineapple. But it's time to eat dinner. Hey guys, finished dinner and stuff. It's 6.48 p.m. at the moment. And I think I'm like five minutes short, maybe four, four or five minutes short on the video today. Um, yeah, didn't film enough. There's days like yesterday where I had too much footage Days like today when I don't have enough, and it's just always lands somewhere in between. Yep, well, yeah, I'm just watching some Netflix and some YouTube and some stuff, and I don't know, pretty soon I'll probably, not sure. I gotta switch over my clothes, I think, in the washer. I put them in, I gotta throw those in the dryer. I'm gonna go do that now, because then later I gotta shower and the towels in the 
washer so that needs to get dried so then I can dry off after my shower. So that's what I'm gonna go do. I'm gonna go change the clothes, but I'll talk to you guys again because I still need like three more minutes of footage. So yeah, the dryer's going. You might be able to hear it in the background. But now I'm kind of just chilling here now in the common area for everyone. And yeah, living the life. Student ID card. Got some fortune cookies in the back. Random fortunes. It's not really focusing. Oh well, you can pause it and read it maybe. But yeah, today was all right. Um, today's the 24th. Oh dang, one week to Halloween. The daily vlog series is getting closer and closer to its end. Which is all right. Daily vlogging for a month is kind of tedious and it's the same stuff. We'll get back more to like regular videos next month. I might still daily vlog, but it's not going to be every day. I might throw in like a vlog video once a week or something. I don't know. That way they're fun to make without doing it every single day. I mean, it's not like they're not fun to make, but... It's kind of the same stuff, you know, because I go to college and then it's the weekend and you kind of see the same things here and there. Like the river yesterday, that was cool, that was something different, but primarily it's similarly the same stuff, but that is showcasing my life. Anyway, I have a good one. So yeah, that's the day, everyone. I mean, it's 7.07 p.m., but... I'm like not gonna do anything else. I still need like a minute here left on the daily vlog and yeah, so I'm gonna do these dishes, wait for the dryer there to finish, bring that stuff in. Then I'm gonna end up showering, brushing my teeth and stuff and getting ready for bed and for tomorrow. It's kind of what's what's up and what's going to take place. But today was good. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Um, if you liked it, hit the like button. It means a lot to me. If you find yourself watching my content and aren't subscribed, it would mean a whole lot if you could hit that subscribe button. It really does help out the channel and me. And yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Take care. God bless, and I will see you all in the next one.